Okay. Oh, we got... Today we got useless uh, artifact and artifact. Free artifact and, bought, and purchase artifact. Yeah. Or we got or... spell purge cavern. And that's the upgrade spells, right? Yes. Uh, and I, 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 I do like more as, purge. I was say, as much as I love the idea of getting two or, two or more artifacts here, mm. I think we ha well, we still have so much bloat in the deck. Yeah, I, I agree. It hurts uh, not going left there, but I think it's the right let's, choice. Let's cavern first, just yep. to see what that does. Ooh, hello there. Historian. Oh, uh, blah, blah, blah. Recording event for posterity. All right, so we can get this. Um, A one-time period yeah. use. Of just money. Of just money, which we could literally have that be a four times right now. The, uh, this is just an artifact, which is just yep. our fire gets damaged for every monies we have. Yep. And, and petty theft. Uh, deal two damage to an enemy unit, and if we kill them, get 50 gold. Yep. Um, petty theft's not bad. Petty theft's not bad, and especially with the way that our deck is yeah. set up, that's going to be just a free cast pretty much every time it comes up. And we can theoretically... Upgrade this. To so do more damage, yeah. yeah. I'm okay with that. Yeah. Sneaky but smart, I see. Well, uh, I shall have to change the narrative to support the truth, but nothing a uh, few hours of editing can accomplish. <laughs> Here's something for your assistance. Best of luck to you in the battle's ahead. Okay, so we go remove two more sewers? Yep. Get these stewards out of here. Or and one then... steward and a torch? Yeah, you know what? I think I like that. These torches suck. We have, we, we have a lot of stuff to get rid of. Uh, hey, upgrade up spell with... I think that's perfect. Yeah. Because we can get so much money. We can just make all of our money back. Yeah. See, because that's much more likely to kill an enemy unit. Correct. Now, that Ember Stone, I'm going to have a question mark on. I think that, yeah, that's 100%. Yeah. Because there's Stackstone, which is what I've been yeah. looking for this whole time. So we could put that on the gain 8 Frostbite, apply 8 Frostbite, and now suddenly that becomes a apply 16 Frostbite to a target. It makes the card go back up yeah. to a 1 cost. But I think 1 is reasonable. Uh, yeah, I think that's okay. And as long as we actually cast something more expensive, it's still a 0 cost. That's true. We can go nuts with that. So, uh, yeah. I, I, I think that's just, we do that. Uh, with that, if we put an Emberstone on an X card, does that, how's that work? Um. Does that just? Uh. Okay, so it's just, it will do X plus one damage. So, so, you, so you can cast it for free and it will still do two damage. Don't yeah, you? or we can cast it for four and it's as if we cast it for five. Yeah. That's potentially good. Um, we could also just put that on like the Horfrost because that was one of the things yeah, you would the, say. The, that, that's absolutely where I want to put it. Yeah, go ahead, yeah, go ahead and do that. Uh, that said, I don't know if I would want to make it cost one because it costing more than all of these... Makes, it so, makes that, it so that everything else will be free. Correct. I don't want it to be yeah, it costs more expensive. Too, I, think, I think that's good. Now, the next question is, do we purge something else? Because we still got a lot of purge. Do we re-roll and try to go for more upgrades? Um, I think we purge, but not necessarily re-roll. Okay. I think... Uh, I want to get rid of these Purging torches. another torch. Yeah, I, these three gotta go eventually, but... Yep, the, the, I'm down. The torches are bad. The vents aren't even that good until they're upgraded. Do, do we want to go full nuts and just purge another card while we're here? It's expensive, but we can afford it. Screw it. Let's just... We're going balls to the wall with our money. I, I will say that if we spend this purge now, we will, ha we will likely have to spend a purge later, as opposed to if we come up no. to another... Yeah, yeah, check the map. Um, because we can go to Unstable oh, Vortex yeah, and turn. discard two things. Either next turn or the oh. turn after that. Yeah. Yeah, so let's save our money. Yeah, because if we come up uh, to that vent and have to get rid of 
one card will be fair. Oh, random artifact with spikes four. Spikes four. Let's spikes see. is admittedly a little scary. Yeah, because our guys are especially with our our sweeps. They'll be like, everybody takes damage, and they're like, sweet, that means you take every spike. Yeah, I think just because of the sweep, I don't think we can do it. Oh, this boss also sweeps, which is Oof. scary. As much as I want the artifact, yeah. I think let's play yeah. it safe, let's play it smart. Yeah, I think this one might be a little spicy. What we got? Yeah, we got that with the tank. Let's see... This guy is a sweeper as well. Yep, so vent, vent them out. Let's see, what is his... Oh, that's on Slay. That's on a killing blow. Yep. Okay. So vent, and then the other two are free. Yep. And then just... Bop, bop. He's already dead. Boom. Oh. Thank you, armor, because oh. <laughs> I had to hit that... I had to take that shot first. Uh, that is our better... Uh, better siren, yeah. so we should probably put that on the bottom. Yeah. Uh, use the torch. Yeah, we got four mana. Perfect. Use the torch on the guy up top. Oh no, because it's three yeah. health. Um, there's that. Yeah. <laughs> and then. Yep. Bing. And flash. Oh. So much cold. <laughs> it's it's very frosty. I like it. Uh, oh, we got some petty theft here. Yes, we do. Um, but I don't know if we can... Yeah, I don't think we can set off the petty theft, which is a little sad. It is sad. Uh, are one of those guys going to survive? Uh, but then we discard the petty theft anyway. Hmm. I was like, mate, like I can even do a double cast, but it's not going to help. We don't have enough spell damage in this yeah. hand. That's unfortunate. Uh, Alright, so we'll just set up for some units. Oh, I'll just double that up and... Yeah. Okay. Uh, Energy Siphon doesn't get rid of itself, right? So yeah, I mean, we might as yeah. well Energy Siphon Petty Thief something just to put the damage out. Eh. Okay, well, there's the silence. Yep. It's all spells, so we can just vent that bottom floor for free. Well, not for free, but vent the bottom floor and then everything yeah. else is free. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. and then we're, I think we just... We need just new him. Even the Horfrost effigy, it's, it'll give him two Frostbite. I suppose that's true. <laughs> so it's unfortunate. He is going to be going up. Yeah. Yeah, he's going to have a lot of help on that top. That's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll have some spells to, to deal with him. Yeah. Yeah. Like so. Uh, he's oh, he's actually he... very close. Ooh. Oh. Uh, no, we can. I, we? We, I think we can do this. Especially oh, we with could, the, Yeah, we the... could energy siphon him. Oh, and in fact, just. Just the energy siphon. Yeah. yeah. So uh, well, well, so once again, you vent the bottom floor first. Oh, there's no one else around. Yeah, it's a brief respite. Doesn't matter. All right. So yeah, energy siphon and then petty theft. Woo, money. And then everyone just hangs out for a turn. Yep. Our commander is in trouble, but we can totally do this. Yeah, Silence! Uh... So he, so the silence makes it so yeah. that he loses everything, right? He no longer has sweep. He no longer has. Yeah, and then he just. Eh. Uh, he is surviving, unfortunately. Yeah, but I think he's going to have. He's going to have many stacks. Of... Oof. Uh. Not as many because the, because he still has a sweep. Where's the silence? Science only stays for one attack. And then now we have a lot more frostbite that we can add yep. to the table. And he's dead. He's super dead. Oh, we can't petty theft him to death, unfortunately, but. 
I mean, I'm still gonna hit him with it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and it takes that frostbite to explode. And the lone survivor, the train steward up top. I did it, guys. Choo choo. <laughs> Victory. Yay. I don't think we need those. Yeah, we don't need any of that. Whoa. <laughs> Impish scholar, <laughs> impressive, and in flame. I don't think we need any of that either. I agree. All right. All right, so we can do purge, nothing, and duplicate. Yeah, we have a couple of cards that would be yeah. worth duplicating. Yeah, or or money, we can upgrade our forge units and cabinets. Uh, that's a question mark. Um, as far as duplicate, uh, we could duplicate uh, that double stack flash freeze. Yeah, double stack flash freeze. Petty theft. <laughs> uh, the the funky vent. Funky vent. We could get another steel worker. For another floor. On oh, one. yeah. And just in case that bottom floor gets nuked again, we'll actually have a second floor that's been building up armor over time. I like that. I mean, even doing a double steel worker champion <laughs> just to, so this guy can just do his work yeah. unimpeded. We wouldn't have the strike at that point. Or, I mean, the sweep at that point. That's correct. On that same floor, but it's still a potential. It's just we'd have the option. Correct. Um, so I don't hate the idea of upgrade. I think I, I think that side would both that would be good on both sides. Okay. Um, well, which one do you like better? Um, check the map again, because what's the next the next vent we get? Or the unstable vortex. There's an unstable vortex yeah. on all three of these. Uh, so Merchant of Steel wait. and money. Okay. And then the, the, the pyro remains are on the opposite side, so we wouldn't feel as bad yeah. about it. So, yeah, I actually say go Let's left, go left this, time, this time, and then we'll go right afterwards. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Grab the money, grab the caverns. Doing all, we're doing a lot of random guesswork with these caverns. We've, we've hit the just fun. about every cavern. The bone shaker. Stops near an abandoned remains of a train. It looks like it belonged to a merchant. Say a few remaining goods from the clans of Hellhorn to Woken and Stygian Guard are out in the open for the taking, but something may cause the men and remain to fall to pieces. So we get a consumable card from one of the three. Hmm. They're consumables, so they don't hold up the deck too, too much. But, but it's random. random. But random could be fun. But it could also be poopy. It's I mean, true. if we're going for Frostbite... Look for a Stygian. A Stygian random. could do it, maybe. But I don't necessarily like the idea of just a random card going in the deck. That's fair. I think we just leave. I think we also could take it, and if it's real bad, we could just remove it at the shop we're about to walk into. Yeah, but then that's extra money that we could be that's put true. towards other stuff. That's true. But my my votes walk away. Okay. So sometimes you gotta it's know when to walk away. Boring though. Look. Sometimes War. you gotta know when to walk away. For the hell! Oh, multi strike, mm. multi strike on the frost sweeper. That could be pretty good. Yeah, it could. Uh, so then we gotta figure out: do we want buff one or multi frostbite in one? I'm okay either way. <laughs> It depends on then what then what her next upgrade is. I'd love to get it quick. Quick would be real nice. Uh, or I can give her a strength stone just so just so she can do, do more damage. But then it's it, you know it's eleven, yeah. eleven times two, which is mm. not bad. But we're here for the frost. Well, do we want to reroll to try to find more fancy stuff? Uh, I kind of do personally. <laughs> There's quick. All right then. That's what you were just thinking, right? Just just get a quick multi-strike frostbite. The problem is this damage isn't significant enough. True. I actually think we actually quick this one and then give it a strength stone. Because the benefit of the quick is to 
get out those back guys before they can do anything. That's true. And doing one damage twice still won't kill a lot of... That is true. Yeah, yeah. that's true. The, the, the sweeper... Yeah. The frostbite sweeper doesn't need quick. It just She yeah. either needs more frostbite or more multi-strike. Yeah, so... But at that point, is making her quick with 11 damage sweep, is that good enough? I think... Yeah, okay, I'm down. Uh, I agree that the, 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 the multi-striker doesn't actually want the quick. If we could have gotten multi-strike quick and the plus 10 power, then it would be easy. But yeah. But we're just going to have a, a bunch of differently upgraded... Yeah. The, ...Coldicias. So then, then give her the power. And then I say you give the remaining one just extra health because it's just like you're here just just to apply more frostbite. So the the longer you live, the better. So we could, I mean, we could do that, or we could hold out for more multi strike or more frostbite. We could, but I I we haven't had like fully upgraded units. No, it's true. Ever. All right, go for it. That's fine. I like the idea of just look. Everything we play is going to be pretty decent. Yeah. Uh, we're not going to purge because we're going to purge next time. Yep. We are, we only have two things we want to get rid of right now anyway. Okay. So, yeah. All right. So now, no matter which Koldasia we grab, it'll be a decent one. Yes. Okay, so this one's got a multi-strike. Ten and damage. That's it. Her uh, guardians have multi-strike and then fell empowers units with rage. So, Okay. multi-strike rage is a little scary. So I think they only get the rage when they're on the same floor? Yes. Okay. That well. means the bottom one's not doing anything fancy. Alright, uh, this that's... is the multi-striking one. Yep. Which is fine. And then put the steel in front of it. And then we can just... And then you want to slap the siphon on the boss to just get it ready? Oh yeah. We're just going to start stacking that bad boy up. Unfortunately, that uh, guardian was a guardian. Yeah. But that's okay. Oh, there's two more. Two more sirens. Uh, oh, we can petty theft! Yes, we can. Uh, so, let's just get these ones up. This is the tanky one, so this will be up front. Yep. And this one will be the one behind it. Yep. And then we'll vent for two, which will make these free. Yep. Uh, keep in uh, mind that if you do that, you're going to hit the boss. That is true. Um, so I think I'm just going to Petty Theft Torch and not vent. Well, well if you're going to do that, you might as well oh, vent or, right there. I, yeah, I could vent here. Yeah, I okay. think you vent there. Sure. And then give it one. <coughs> and then torch that one. Uh, that um, gains a couple I, of armors, I think that's still fine. But that's fine. Because he's also going to gain a ton of frost, so he's going to go up to the next floor. He's going to rise to the next floor, and he'll not survive the frostbite there. Uh, Alright, so now this is interesting. Uh, yeah, you could see right here for frost. Well, I have to do it to everything in the same unit. If the boss was here, uh, I could have... You uh, could still do it up top. That guy's he's only got 10, but you could take that 10 and put it on the boss. And, that, double, and double his 15 to... Would, would that... Cause uh, frost it's not taking not damage. damage spell. So you'd move the 10 onto the boss yeah. and then double the 15 to 30. Uh, but then this guy is still making a getaway here. Uh, so I think we'd have to accept that... He would have to get dealt with uh, up there, but the the pyre the the pyre will take care of it in one hit. Yes, so it'll take a hit, which is a little scary. But th it's not going to die anyway. Correct. So, well, I mean, I suppose it theoretically could have it would have died if we hoarfrosted the other direction, 
and put it on uh, him. Yeah, I suppose that's but true. But I think our core taking 11, yeah. like what? Uh, it wouldn't even be 11 damage because this rage will go down. So it'll be like 9 damage. I think 9 damage is fine. Uh, this guy just needs a little bit of uh, coaxing. Yep. Um, and then the frozen lance can go on. This guy will get 10 armor if I do that. So, so. put him on the top floor? Uh, yeah. He, we need to ping away at him too. And I can't put the train steward up there because he'll just immediately he'll just die. die. Correct. So I'll just... Yeah, it's the one hit. But we knew that. Okay, we got a big vent. We could just vent those guys to oblivion. Yep. And then... That's free. Oh, let's see. That thing's already dead. Uh, this thing's not quite dead. In fact, it's barely going to take any damage at all. Uh, yeah, because the guy in front's got so much health. He's just going to soak it all up. Hmm. So we can just apply a crap ton of frostbite to him. Yeah. And then again, frozen lands on the top. Uh, yeah, because this one's already dying. Yep, dying so. to the quick. Alright. Add some more of that frostbite, make sure it don't stack down. You won't die if I put you here. Yay! All right. Uh, uh, she's it, perfectly dead, even without the attacks. Yep. Uh, uh, she is getting hurt there. Do we vent that bottom floor? Uh, do we want to expend the spell weaknesses? Uh, yeah, I think we do. Uh, it's it's gonna be. A, oh no! This is a poopy vent. That's, that is the poopy vent. So no. Uh, a little help. And that will die. That's true. So, yeah, I say we don't vent. We just keep... If it was a big well, boy vent, I and would. Then at that point, you vent, like, the top floor or something. Yeah, I suppose that's true. To do something. I'm we'll slowly get that guy away. Well, that train is super dead. Oh... <sighs> Yeah. That said, or frost energy on the boss again. I mean, it just doubles his frost. I mean, I guess it does. Yeah. yeah. It just... It's like we transfer an additional none to him and then give him thirty nine more frost. <laughs> uh, we can do some petty thievery over here. I think that's a good idea. Think. And then maybe we can make sure the bottom guy dies, or we can start doing damage to. I don't even think we can make sure the bottom guy dies. Uh, with the frozen lance? It's not enough. Is it not? Oh. I mean, numbers, James. I'm, I was looking at the number wrong. <laughs> Drawn Hort Frost again, that would have been so good. That's a baby vent, uh, uh, but so. still, baby vent in the top floor is not a bad idea. Yep. So we don't trigger the, the spell. Uh, let's see. Uh, we can frost this guy up so he doesn't hit the core, or yep. we can just be like, the core will take five damage. Uh, is the front the core going to take five? Yeah, because he's got one stack of rage, so he'll go down to five attack by the time he gets up here. And... Uh, he'll take... The, he'll, the core will take yeah. ten, because he'll, he'll, the core won't be enough to kill him unless we hit him at least once. <laughs> if we do that, then the core will take five. Which is nice. 
And then I think we just unload on this guy. Yep. So he's already dead. So middle floor. He's already dead. He's already dead, but he's killing the... Nope, no, because because quick. Yeah, exactly. So... Just keep coming away at that, that front guy. Yep. Uh, wave. All right. This hey, is what... there's the big vent. Well, hey, hey, look, one more, <laughs> one more of these. Yep. I, I mean, this boss is already dead, by the way. Yes. But uh... hit him anyway. Well, it, it wasn't that impressive. <laughs> it's no. Damage. But hit him with everything. Just <laughs> kick his butt. Eh. You're silent. Shush. I don't think he is. Oh yeah, he's so frosty. So much frost. Two hundred frost. Very cool. That's pretty good. Ooh, another effigy. I don't know if we need another effigy, but whew. Uh, harness the Titan. Apply plus five magic power to spells in hand. <laughs> considering with our build. Is that permanent or just for that turn? I don't know, but it's going to cost zero when we <laughs> play it. Like, hmm. I would say either another Horfrost Effigy to do more doubling of the Frostbite, but it's really hmm. only used on the boss, so I don't know if the yeah. second one is that useful. Yeah. And Harness the Titan might take up some space, but it's also real strong. I mean, especially, like, you say it'll be free, but I'd rather play this first, so I'd rather get an Ember Stone to make this cost zero. You play this first that's, to make... That's, well, yes, uh, that's also yeah. true. Yeah, let's so. go for it. I said grab it. Alright, so now... Um... I think we're getting more space. More space is probably uh, good. Because that way we can... It's really only... Truly helpful for like our second floor. Yeah. With our ability to make our spells cost zero, an extra draw wouldn't necessarily be terrible. That is true. Well, you know what? I, I I like that plan. Or just get more energy because X costs. Oh, because X costs. That's but, true. But, but our X know, costs are kind of poopy. Yeah, they're not that strong. Yeah, I think the the compound yeah. is my is my call. Let's do it to it. Okay, right, so, so we said we were going to the right, right? Yeah, yeah, we had already pre preordained. So we're going this so we're side. Going this side. Burn those two cards. Mm -hmm. That last torch and that last train steward. Woo. Alright. And then Merch into the steel. Oof. Let's see. I don't think we have Oh, any... do we have any units to upgrade? Not currently. Huh. So then, there's literally nothing we can do here. That is true. I, I hadn't thought of that. Potent, potential mistake on our part, but that's okay. That's fine. We'll treat we'll treat it as if that was the heal the pyre thing. Frostbite four. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that's strong. I, like, I mean, he's also doing sixty damage yeah. when he hits two, so that is a net hundred damage every time he hits something. It's not bad. Uh, all right. On onward we go. Uh, so non-boss enemies get stronger. Get plus eight attack. But for double our money. Yeah, but I don't think we need the money. Plus, these guys are zero attack with a lot of armor. Yeah. If the, they have eight attack, they're a problem. That's true. Well, that's all right. Let's yeah. just fight that. And then sweep guys with yeah, that's head true. attack. No, thank you. That's fair. Trample. When attacking, excess damage is applied to the subsequent enemy unit. Yeah. They, they've just gone straight so up he, with magic on us. If he kills a dude. Hey, look at this. We got uh, a setup here. Uh, that's the quick one. Which I think is fine. And the thing's already dead. But we can we can test out the Harness the Titan. Uh, yeah. Just might as well try it. So that's... We do eight points. Now, next time we draw that, let's see if it still says eight points. Wow. 
Alrighty. Oh, why do we have one mana? Why do we have one mana? What happened? What? Oh, look, look at the discard pile real quick. Did we misread? No? It must be something that that guy did that I didn't notice. Yeah, well, we must have, admit, we must have just not read a thing. Well, I'm going to use this one mana to... Penny theft on that guy. It's just, just me. stealing all the money. Well, yeah. I, I would like to set these guys up, but... Yeah. It's just a lot of money. Yeah. And then I'll... I'm going to siphon on you, because you will survive. Well, in fact... Yeah. I'm no, just, kill him. Just, <laughs> yeah, just go away. Apply Ember Drain 1, 1 to the attack unit when it attacks. And then it sweeps, so it hit us for 3. 3, okay. Huh. Oh, I don't like that at all. What an asshole. We have stuff on all of our units, too. Where'd those come from? The, pur no, the purple things. Oh, oh that's just yeah. showing. Oh, okay. It, 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 all of our guys do stuff, as it turns no, out. No, yeah, I knew that. I just, I guess I didn't notice the... The purple before. Okay. Um. Well, unfortunately, we can't kill him before he does that ember drain to us. Yeah. <laughs> and then just frozen lances go. Random bullshit go. Oh, we could. It's a one-time use, but we could throw down the unnamed tome just so that we don't get hit with the. With the Ember Drain? Uh, is it worth it, do you think? I don't know. How, how, how well can you handle the next turn with zero mana? Yeah, well, well, with one mana? I'll go for it. Uh, I'm not drawing my freaking Koldasias at this, so I no. can set up, which is... You will next turn, basically. Uh, let's see. I'll see a big boy vent at the bottom. Unless you want to drop the uh, energy siphon on the front guy first. Um, I was thinking about energy siphoning and then big boy venting this guy. Uh, that's true. Although we're oh. no, no, we're gonna frost him to. Oh, it did stay. It stayed. Uh, we can actually frost him to death, I think, because if we put mm -hmm. another sixteen frost on him and then hit him with the hoar frost, he'll have. Well, if you're going to do that, you yeah. vent the bottom first so that it's free, right? Huh. Yeah, makes sense. Now he's dying. And then you hit him with the Flash Freeze and then the Horror Frost to hit him with another 16 Frost and then double his Frost, putting him at 68 Frost. And then you can just <laughs> yeah, ping him with the Frozen Lance and then he's going to be dead? Yeah, now he's super dead. You say super dead. He's just dead. Well... Yeah, but if he had survived, he would have taken another 67 on the next floor. So oh, he was, yeah. He was super dead. There's, uh, our, there's our pretties. And we're going to be silenced, so let's set them up now. Yep. Uh, okay, so... I'll have... Harness! Behind. Definitely harnessing. Petty theft is up to 17! Uh, if we could have, if we can give Petty Thief piercing, wouldn't that be something? I mean, it is a, a thing that I think you can put spells. Yeah. So then, just hit someone to some damage. <laughs> oh, that ever drain. That hurts a lot because we can't make it make the things free. So we like we could hit him when put some frost on him, or we can harness yeah, I, setting I up for later. I think we just harness to set up. I think I agree. It hurts because that's a lot of spells it's hitting right now. Yeah. Um, I mean, and I even for zero. zero. Yeah. I'll still do an extra 25. Oof. We got 
Ember again, but it's okay. We can still vent and do things. Hmm. I mean, this guy's dead. All these guys are dead, but he's also dead. That's true. So I can just worry about him. Yeah, so just vent him and then... Energy siphon. Yeah, now he's already dead. Yeah, so now he'll die. And we just throw those on him because why not? And then every, everything down there's dead, but he'll die to frost out. My team is perpetually dead but victorious. Yeah, that's the, that's the idea. Team Furic victory. Yeah. Hey, look. <laughs> Poor Frost Eye Nah, I don't think we need it. Yeah, I don't think we need any of this. Nope. I don't think we need any of this either. Nope. The Consume Rage is... Yeah, but... All right, so we don't need to burn a card, but do we want to duplicate a card? Uh, and that is also the spell upgrade, which is yeah. nice. Uh, this side is a Pyre Health, which we could actually use. Uh, this, which we cannot absolutely use Correct. at all. And some money. I actually say... Yeah, let's go left. Like, we can't use that, so but... let's upgrade a spell. Uh, yeah, definitely we'll upgrade first. Ooh, hold over. Mm. So we can have a spell every turn. <laughs> Petty theft every turn. Every turn. Harness, Harness the, the titan, titan every turn. For, for free every turn. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. That, that seems pretty good. <laughs> I mean, no matter what else is going on, we can just pop every turn. It's like our spells will get stronger and stronger and stronger, baby. I think we throw the Power Stone on something, because why the hell not? Uh, throw it on the Petty Theft. Yeah, make it more likely to kill stuff. Yeah. Uh, or we can put it on this event, so it's just guaranteed at least 10 damage. That's true. I think I like that better. Yeah, go for it. Because I want to hold out for... I might want to do a reroll to see if I can That's get true. that pierce. So I say before you reroll, go to the other... The trinket shop, just to see. Yeah, good, good call. Uh, when a card with consume is played, deal 30 damage to the front enemy unit. Uh, when you play your third spell of the turn, all cards gain plus one magic power for the rest of this battle. It's sort of a theme. That's pretty good. And we play... We like, do play multiple spells per turn. Yeah. And it's all cards. Not all cards in hand, it's all cards. Your whole deck gets plus one magic power. Yeah, so I, I think we grab this. I think that's pretty good. Now, do you want to reroll those? We have enough money where I think we can comfortably reroll here. Sure. Uh, another consume thing. Pyro starts you battle with armor 15. Yeah. Uh, range does not decay on front. That, in a different deck, is amazing. Yeah, that's crazy. Not for well, this I don't time. think we need them. So, okay, we'll walk away and go reroll the other shot. Yeah. Oh, permafrost. Um, hmm. So we can hold on to something until we need it. If there's anything we even need. Yeah, okay. that, well, that's what I'm trying to think. Like, what would we put that on? Like, Emberstone probably goes on something, because why wouldn't it? Yeah. That could. We could put it on the vent, and then it's the. Uh, it, oh, I mean, it's not really needed, but uh, just make make something the cost freeze zero. free or something. I don't know. Uh, what are other options again? Uh, Twenty magic power and consume, or and then permafrost. And I don't think there's anything we need permafrosted. Yeah, it's really nice. It's just sad though. And the Emberstone's less useful because we have the Anvil. Yeah, but we can still do it. I mean, we have no other real use for our money. Even if well, my only else. thought is putting it on the Flash Freeze because then it will go back to a one cost if we eventually get a double stack. Uh, isn't this the last thing before the... Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like, this is it. So if we're putting things on, we're putting things on and walking away. Um... Well, then maybe we still do make this cost one and just rely on vents to make things free. Sure. And even if they're not free, then it costs one. 
Sure, we can do that. Um, honestly, do you want to put a surge stone on the uh, on one of the uh, the frost shots? Because it's just the the frozen lances. Because it's just six damage to the front end of the unit. Do we want one that's big damage and then it's just out of the deck? Yeah, so I, I like that. Deck. Get it out of here. And then, yeah, unfortunately, I don't think. There's and in fact, I I think purge another one just because those are our weakest cards right now. It's true. So I say, if we have enough money. Purge both of them? Purge both of the off offending ones. Because that means that we're more likely to get our flash freezes and our vents and our whore effigies and our harness. Well, the harness titan will show up every turn once it shows up. Uh, but once we get all of the stuff out of our deck, that yeah. means we're drawing flash freezes and horror effigies like almost every turn and yeah. vents. That's true. Because these are the like the ones we don't want. Yeah. So yeah, let's get that out of here. And then we have the consume last one, so we'll play it once for big damage. It's out of there. Is there any is there anything that we could put out put the put the free stone on just because? <laughs> like Um I mean, we're gonna be playing that every turn. Uh see my problem is like most of these we're just gonna we're just gonna be playing them every play turn. Them and our deck is small enough where we're probably gonna be playing just about everything every turn. Yeah, that's true. So I, I say this we don't need no. to. Eh, okay. It's like if you want to just put it on something just it's to just, put it on something, it, we it can. feels thematically appropriate. Let's get a permafrost fire event. Yeah, I like it. <laughs> uh, and now do we want to duplicate any of these? I think we do. Um, because... Because we pulled more spells out of the deck, we're more likely to. Yeah, a double duplicating this double stack flash yeah, freeze. Double stack flash freeze, I think, is amazing. Y you think that's the play? I think that's the play. I would have loved to have upgraded the other one, but I think that's the play. All right. I like it. And then, why did we spend money to <laughs> to purge those two cards? <laughs> <laughs> because it's the end and we're just walking away. <laughs> you, still have, you still have to click on the vent too, even because they won't let us until we look. What a do we pack of morons we are? Yeah, it happens. <laughs> now look, like, it was a bunch of extra money. We were yeah, done, like so we it doesn't matter. But yeah, uh, Seraph will remove half of any buff and debuff effect stacks. That is a little unfortunate, but I think it'll be fine. Again, I do wish that that would be more specific. Mm. Is that every turn? Is that just when they're applied, she cuts it in mm. half? Is that every time she attacks? Like, what do we... Be more specific. We vent that bottom row, something fierce. Yes, please. We'll kill three dudes. From uh, what does he get when we... The front guy get? What's his... Uh, a lot of armor. So he'll gain 15 armor if we vent there. I'm just considering... Well, no, it doesn't... I'm like, I want a Penny Theft first to get money. Why do I care? You don't care. I don't care. So, yeah, we're gonna... I think it's still worth it, because that'll save us a lot of damage. Yeah. yeah. So then the question becomes... Do we flash freeze him, or do we flash freeze him? Uh, I think we flash freeze the boss. And then one plus one magic power, baby. Yep. Oh, this this guy. We could just immediately silence that bottom floor if we wanted. Uh, just to keep that. Yeah, I sort of like that plan. Because uh, we can't we can't kill him before he sweeps, and that'll. Hurt a lot. Right, so. I'm gonna vent him out again. Um, or do you want to put down the cold, the, the sirens first? Yeah, let's set up sirens here. This one will take some damage, but we'll get even more frost axe on the boss. And then we'll do. 
this. And then we'll do... Don't bother. I'm the boss. He's, she can remove the stacks from herself. Yeah, but how often? Well, we don't know, but I think she's already missing. Well, well everyone else is already dead, so it doesn't matter. Oh! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh, how much damage is that the guy in front of her taking? From our units? 22, right? Yeah. Uh, Horfrost effigy and put all of those stacks on the boss. I already was going to, but oh, I was okay. also going to energy siphon because yeah, I can do yeah. it all for free. Go for it. That was already part of the plan. 110 frost. 116 frost because of the extra frost. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I think yep. it's every turn. Yeah, okay. Just cut so. It in half. so okay. Good to know. Good to know. So if we're doing that, we gotta harness. Oh, just every turn, baby. Oh. Yeah, every turn. So again, vetting that bottom just to get that started. Yep. And then, do we start laying into that back guy, or do we just keep stacking more frostbite on the boss? Um. Yeah, let's let's just go hard on this boss. It's just It's like you yeah, actually remove half of yeah. the frozen stacks, but that just means we have to put more and more stacks on her. <laughs> it's like now admittedly that angel up there is still uh, still kicking pretty hard. Yeah. Harness the Titan! <laughs> So good. Uh, so we'll just do this, just to, uh, uh, spend it do, immediately. Yeah, do more from the vent. And, and just, um, uh, yeah, this will do the most damage. So yeah, and then I'll make everything else free. So yep. bonk. Uh, keep in mind the angel on that middle floor is. Still currently problematic. Uh, yeah, I suppose that is true. But we also could just potentially just ignore it. It's going to take some frost, and then it's going to take some hits. And then even if it gets up to the to the pyre, it's just like whatever. We're going to kill this thing. We're going to kill <laughs> Seraph. Uh, even, that's even if the pyre ridiculous. takes damage, it's like whatever. Uh, let's see, because I can. Yeah, <laughs> unfortunately. Like, the, the, the back guys are sneaking. Are sneaking, yeah. Um, thinking about just going hard on this guy and then doubling up all his frostbite and then just letting this happen. Yeah, I think that's okay. I'm okay with that. Oh, we're in... Em Ember drained. Yeah, I, I knew that was gonna happen. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. hardest to time. Every turn, baby. Uh, we're only gonna get to play one of these now. Oh, and this guy is in trouble. He's gonna survive at least. He's gonna survive. And then he's gonna go up to the col to the pyre and the pyre. Well, the pyre's up to forty power. It'll you kill it in two hits. Yeah. Do you, do, if we have one spell. Do we just do we just I, frost him? I think we do. Okay. I'm a little nervous about some things, but Oh, I'm, I'm very nervous when it comes to some things, but being ember drained. <laughs> yeah, like I knew he was going down to one. I knew it was bad. Stop it with the ember drain guy. I hate him. Oh, this one's going to die. This okay. one's gonna get, die. Get that bent out of the way. We vent on that bottom floor. We might be okay. I think I energy siphon vent this guy. Yeah. Uh, this is the big that one. That is the bigger one, yes. This is starting to get a little scary, honestly. Yeah. 
prevent the middle floor then? For something? Uh, yeah. yeah. Can we, do we have any way of saving? No, we have no there, way There's no way I'm going to kill this guy. That's unfortunate. So I'm just going to spend my, my time doing as much as I can here, I think. Which will save her at least. Yeah. Once again, he's going to get up and hit the core twice. Yeah, I think that's okay. Do we, do we just keep focusing, or do I try to try to weaken these guys? I think we've got enough health on the pyre that you keep focusing. Especially since we're, we're losing our tank on that bottom. And we're going to need to boss it down as fast as possible. I think we're going to have to more like this. Oh. Yeah, it's not it's not pretty no matter what we do, but oh. Mars yeah. Titan, we were Ember trained again. Uh, we didn't draw No, we didn't draw uh, we didn't draw uh, Let's see. These guys will survive. Yeah. So I but could that's the second angel again, it's just ugh. What's going on on the higher floors again? I'm just gonna keep an eye on those other two. This one's gonna die. There's nothing I can do to stop that. And then uh, he's gonna do. He's gonna hit the core three times, unfortunately. Uh, and if I, I can, I can hit him to stop that. I'll hit him to slow him down. It's, it sort of sucks because I wanted to to double stack and then horfrost him. Yeah. But we do have to be at least a little safe of the core. So now the core's only going to get twice. Yeah, this, this is looking a little rough, admittedly. Do you still... I I think I might. No, but remember, you've only got one mana here. Yeah, I know. You still need just but Horror Frost. I think just get this guy out of the way. Flash freeze that guy. So that, yeah, to make sure he dies. Okay. Okay. Final wave. wave. Oh, that boss is not taking nearly enough damage. That's problematic. Uh, well, g give me a second here. Um, you, <laughs> as, as <laughs> dumb as it is, because that vent has permafrost, we can hold on to it so that we make sure that we have a vent next turn. Mm. Like we're gonna, we're gonna, we draw most of the deck, but if we don't draw a vent, we might be in trouble. I mean, I think we're actually yeah. in trouble either. Way. I, I think we're in trouble either way. I think we just go, go nuts as hard as we can. I think we're. Uh, I think we may have a. We may have an L on our hands here, Lee. Yeah. Uh. And I know. I know that at least some people are gonna be like, "Well, you did. You did know that the boss was gonna remove stacks, but the boss removing stacks is not actually what killed us either. Our biggest issue was the one that was giving us the thing." Oh yeah, oh, that's. Well, it was draining our mana every time. Eh. And it's unfortunate that we didn't draw the 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 hoarfrost here. If we had drawn a hoarfrost here, I don't think it would have saved us, but it would have been real close. Oof. Yeah. Dang. <laughs> oh, well. 
We can't win them all. Our no. streak is over. But we still level up Ascension. Siren Song. Uh, ascend enemy units on this floor and apply days three. Uh, well, I'm sorry. Yeah. That was Pyrebound. Oh, was it? Yeah. So on the top floor, yeah. send everyone up to the core and daze oh. them for three turns. So then our core our can core just, just beat them up. Whap, whap, <laughs> Apply spell weakness two to enemy units when they enter the floor below the pyre room. Okay. Oh, that could potentially be nice. And then uh, unlock squid face. Yeah. Bam! Did you level up again? Cuddle hacks. That thing's super cute. And then turn apply frozen to a random guard in your hand. Okay. Uh, Fifty percent chance to apply spell weakness one when enemy unit enters your train. Okay. Oh yeah. Sure. And the hellhorn didn't even level. Did we summon enough units to unlock Umbra, though? Uh, no. I don't no, think so. That was it. <laughs> dang. Well, well shucks. shucks. Well, dang. That's okay. I still think we did pretty all right. We did. So, uh, next week we'll have a new hero to try out, a new champion. Yep. Uh, probably, probably do Imp Lady, since she was the first one we unlocked, but we haven't... Poked around with it yet? Yeah. Plus, if we do, if we do, Imp Lady, we'll absolutely unlock the Umbra after that. Yes. Because we will absolutely summon twenty nine units if we're going imps. Yeah, <laughs> lots of imps. Yeah, imps for days. But uh, it was a close run. I think we did all right. Yeah. We just had a little bit of bad luck with that one enemy with that one buff. Yeah. Just being like, you can't play all your stuff. It happens. Yep. Yeah. So, uh, we'll try to, uh, use one of these new champions and do something else, and we'll do it next time. Goodbye. Okay,